Well, after very not much longer, I realized, you know, what about over there? And then I covered my mouse over, and then I see that, and it's like, well, son of a bitch. There it is. I can't believe I overlooked that. And then the, the pump is just up above. I was looking around, and I, you know, everything was right there. I was just getting kind of clusterfucked in my head, so... So that's what happens when I record this shit this early in the morning. I just sometimes forget the most basic of shit. Why is he punching that thing? Oh my god, Ian. Ian. We're gonna have to take a hit here. He was only hit for... Apparently, Ian wants to run up, punch it in the face, and then shoot it. Point does, doesn't matter. The f fucking thing is dead. And I'm not fighting this rat. I disagree wholeheartedly with fighting animals that are this t much tinier than I am. On the other hand, I do not disagree with fighting that thing. Because we just raped them both. Now then. Let me switch back to my other weapons. Ian, please come over here and help me. I actually am kind of in trouble. Let us switch to... Yeah, we'll just stay with first. <gasps> and we didn't do enough damage to kill anything, really, except the little rat. Aiming for the big guy, but apparently the little rat took all the bullets. And there's one thing I will fucking be annoyed about this game for the rest of my existence is that it's sometimes got some annoying shit. Okay then, it's dead. Thank you for not shooting me, Ian. Thank you for not shooting me. Okay, so we got the junk. You see junk. I can't believe those pussy ass ghouls over there couldn't do this. But hey, what you gonna do? No! No! I disagree with fighting this little piece of shit. Anyways, the ammo. Thank you, Ian. Thank you. Alright. Now, we need. We need to do something that we actually have not had the opportunity or the inclination, really, to do this entire game so far. Let us save game right here. Reload over that. I don't give a fuck. And we're gonna open up our skill decks. This has our sneak, lockpick, steel traps, or repair. So we're going to repair this now that we got the junk. You failed to repair the water pump. Let's try it again. You failed to repair the water pump. You failed to repair the water pump. It might need a new fuse. Really? Failed to repair. I really needed to put points into this, didn't I? Getting to look that way. Am I not? Am I going to be unable to do it? Because I know in Fallout 2 you can get your companions to do stuff like this. Except I'm not really. I'm just going to be sitting here repairing this thing to the end of time, aren't I? So yeah, let's just reload that. Because I think I fucked it up. I will need to go level up off something. Somewhere, somehow. So. Character. What's my experience at? I got a crippled left arm. I don't remember if I pointed that out or not. We need seven. We need 670 experience. Nope. I disagree. I still disagree with this. Punch the shit out of Ian. Punch the shit out of it, Ian. Just shoot it! Shoot the little rat! Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, let's move on. Now, where is anything in this cave that I can kill for experience? Because I will kill it. There's nothing in here, so we're actually going to have to go back a little bit. 
Looks like we're gonna just have to. I might just go walk around in the desert, go explore a little bit, just to get up that level so we can put a bunch of points into a repair. So, if that's the case, I'm gonna pause this again. No, oh, man, I fucking just stick with it. Whatever. We can always come right back to here when we get back into the town. It's not really that big of an issue. Hopefully, we might be able to find a few things down here we can fight. This place gives me the creeps. Yes, it does me too. And that's where we got killed. That's not where we got the junk. That's where we killed a few things. Is there anything? There's really nothing else to fight. It's kind of the issue, though, because we really need that. We need something to kill. Oh wait, he yes. Here's the parts. Well, it looks like you may need some help with the parts. Here are some books that we have found littered around. They may help you. Now, please take the parts to the watershed. Ooh, they gave us some books. What a nice old guy. Wow, three Dean's Electronics. Okay. You learn a lot about repairing broken electronics. Hell yeah, I'm using all three of these. What is that? Oh, that's the broken electronics parts. I feel kind of dumb now. Like, man, now I'm going to have to go do this and this and this. And, uh, and then this. And then this. Uh, blah, blah. Okay, so there we go. We did that. Maybe now we can actually go repair it. Maybe, 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 maybe this, maybe that. Okay, because we went from 18 to 39. So that's a fair increase. It's a 21 increase, actually. I mean, Jesus Christ! It's not. It's not like. It's not like. Oh, you leveled up. That's like a level up and a half, or the points. I'm cool with this. I am. To I totally like those guys. I feel bad for calling them pansy asses, even though they are. Even though they are. Especially because they are. But that's not the point. It is dark as fuck. Reading those books actually took time, didn't it? That's kind of weird, but I don't question it because we're about to go repair this thing. Woo! I bet if we had a high enough repair, we wouldn't have even needed the junk. That's 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 usually the way it works. So skill decks, repair. Might need a new fuse. So yeah, we still can't repair it. So let us go out reload here so we don't have to walk all that way back and we don't waste any more time traversing maps that we don't want to have to <sighs> so there's those guys do you think I wonder if we can kill him yeah let's try it I actually haven't had a chance to try out this deagle yet. See, do I have, still have the Mauser? I do. I'd, I'd, I'd rather just use up the rest of the ammo for that, which I have a fair bit of. But it shoots fairly quickly. Pop, pop. Blowing through their armor. Okay, they take a fair bit. I just want to see how much experience I get off these guys. We might, I might just kill a few of these. Really? Really? Okay, so one of them gave me 60 experience. Not good. I don't like that. 60 is pretty shit for experience. Especially if, like, if we find some bandits or some raiders or anything, really. We can probably get a lot more than that. Let's go looking out this way. I have no idea what we'll find. I don't care what we'll find. We're reaching the end of our journey. We know there's a water chip down there. And we have a quest that... Yes, something's here. Hey, it's these giant fox. You have stumbled upon a family. A family of mole rats. Aww. Ain't that cute. But it's wrong. Because we're going to kill them. Ian just not he just shot the shit out of that one. I give you props for that one, my friend. And we not only killed the one, but we also damaged the other one right behind it. Which let Ian get a one-shot kill. 
and let us get another kill. I'm happy. I'm happy. And let's kill this other one. And I need to reload. Of course. Let's see if we can get a, a, just a clean shot right in the head. Uh, no. But it set him up for a one shot kill. There should probably be nothing on them. This They didn't really add like the meat drops and shit like that to the later games. For whatever reason. I think that would have helped a lot. But what do I know? These olden games always had that weird kind of... Kind of... Oh, I didn't want to explore that one area right there. Oh well. Zigzagging around the land. Just trying to get that one more encounter so we can possibly level up. Hey, there's a town down. No, that's not a town. That's just a... Um, you know the partially eaten corpse. The remnants of woman. A hunting rifle? Okay, I'll take... I'll take that, thank you, the armor, all that, the Nuka Cola, well, we got ourselves a hunting rifle, that's kind of cool, what's over here, city ruins, huh, there's absolutely nothing, absolutely nothing, sons of a bitch. Maybe we should start making our way back to the Necropolis. It's a pretty crappy way to level up, I'm realizing. Not quite as easy to not quite as easy as in uh, the newer games where you can just like go around, find hey, what is this? Ghouls. I scattered about. You wonder if anything of value could remain? Oh, we might actually be able to find some worthwhile items here. So maybe it's not all bad, except this guy is here, but, I mean, he should be dead now. You're no fighter. I kind of am a fighter, actually. Okay, this guy's pretty tanky. Uh, I don't want to get irradiated, Ian. Ian, 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 you just let him walk past you. Thank you. Cool. Anything of value? Wait, 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 we can't even search this? You have a lot of time on your hands to be looking closely at rotten junk. God damn you, game. There's nothing even here. So I was, I lied. You can't even search this shit. Son of a bitch. It's kind of lame. It's kind of really lame, actually. Let's <sighs> make our way back to the Necropolis. That is what this is, right, Necropolis? I have no idea how many days we wasted doing this, either. It's just another goal. We would have been better off just sitting in the... You know what, I'll be right back. I'm just gonna level up real quick off screen. Be your back, guys. Well, I got to level up. Man, it was pretty much just as easy as going down there, killing those glowing ones, and killing a bunch of those rats. Pretty much cleaned out the sewers and the better majority of that vault down there and stuff. But that's not the point. That's not the point. We can level up our repair now. To 50. Done. That's all I'm doing. Also, I think we're pretty much we're supposed to use the parts on this. There we go. The massive pump struggles to life after you successfully install the missing parts. You earn a thousand experience points for helping the water pump. The ghouls will be grateful. They fucking better be. So, there we go. We leveled up. We fixed the pump. And now, maybe after we go talk... God damn, whenever he hits his head, it scares the shit out of me. Every time. Every time. Anyway, now that we've got all that done, I'm going the wrong way. Yay. Yay. I feel like I'm... Never mind. Moving on. Moving on, let's just go this way. It is still dark as all holy fuck. I'm sorry about that. I can't help that. I can sleep, but I really don't want to waste any more days than I have to. Also, I just kind of... Let's just say I retconned all those days we've spent out there, you know, searching the waste. That was a pretty dumb idea. I'm surprised that in Fallout New Vegas we can just explore as much shit as we do. 
in Fallout 3 with, you know, so little time passing. But, you know, you know, different games, different, different ways of letting it go. But still, moving on, moving on. So now we got that fixed. Let's go talk to this ghoul and see how he's doing. Thank you for repairing the water pump, and I hope all is well with your people when you return with what you have found. Thanks for your help. Goodbye. So apparently now I can just go take the water chip, right? I really hope they don't fight me on my way out, because then I won't really see any point in doing that, what we just did. They'd be like, hey, you know, you know, if you, if you help us, we won't kill you. But, you know, if you helped us, so we're still going to kill you. But thanks. Thanks, man. You did. You did good.